these areas of research are what I believe are probably key to understanding what's beyond the central ghost number. This is the central ghost number cube areas of research. Um, these are the all ten types that a magic ghost number cube can appear in. Um, and they're from proportions 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 8, and 9. And they're stood down ghost number cubes beside them with their, um, I haven't filled this in all the way. <coughs> and these are the complex magic ghost number cubes. If that would show up better. And uh, I'll probably have to enlarge this. These are the reversals of the crosswise and intersection calculations of the cubic octants, the universals of the uniques, and their reverse forms, intersections to cross sections, or intersections to crosswise. And, um, this is of a double helix cube in addition form. Um, these are the full magic ghost number cube field, uh, a full magic ghost number cube field where all eight neighboring cubes combine to create a central cube. I don't know if I can see that too well. Uh, I'll try to enlarge this in a second. These are the six inner ghost number vector orientation forms that I derived from a catalog that I did of all the types of <coughs> possible magic ghost number cube um, forms. And these are the fractal central ghost number cube magic ghost number cube equivalents. How you can turn a fractal cube into its magic ghost number cube form. And um, these comprise all the different areas I believe are key. Um, but thanks a lot. Maybe I can increase this in size. These are the forms that they take. I don't know if I can fit all these on here. These are the You can look in my um, latest research, I believe, to find these 10 types. If this is the best I can show them here. listed by their proportions <coughs> and this is the unique scaffolding of the super hypercube for one strip down and I haven't completed all these strip down pieces yet and um, this is the full magic ghost number cube field a full magic ghost number cube field where the eight neighbor neighborhood creates a central ghost number. And um, that's about it, I guess. Well, 
Thanks a lot. I'll try to explain all of them in the text in the description to this video. And I guess that's it.